Hey guys, I'm Coach Brian Nunez and I'm here live at my training center, the FNS Training Center. And today's workout, I'm joined by Yvonne Lee. She's gonna be jumping in with us and we're gonna get after it. Today's workout is simple, it's fast, it's effective, and it's efficient. But let's make it a little entertaining. Let's have some fun today because that's what training should be all about. Today's a practice day for us to, to get better, for us to be more committed, more dedicated towards reaching our goals. Here's how the workout is gonna go. We're gonna do a warm up, then we've got two circuits, and then we've got a big upper body finisher, okay? So if you're like me, you love those upper body finishers. And if you don't, well then you're gonna learn to love them because we're gonna get after it today. Alrighty, let's get this thing started, guys. We've got eight exercises to get started off in our warm up, and then we'll get in that workout. Don't worry, I've got your back. She's got your back the entire time. Let's have a lot of fun. All right, the first one that we're gonna do, I'm gonna demonstrate, you guys are gonna go through it. You're just going standing, alternating knee hugs, bringing that leg up as high as you can. Let's get started in three, two, one, and up. So the most important part of the warm up is setting your intention, getting your mind right, getting focused. We've got about four minutes right here to get our life together, to get ready to go, to get ready to work. Good. And there's a simple rule, when it starts to burn, we smile. Right, Yvonne, we have that big smile when it gets tough. We've got five more seconds. Five, four, three, big stretch, two, one, and time. The next one we're gonna do is an alternating quad stretch. Now we're gonna make it a little more dynamic going side to side. Reach up, challenge, big stretch in the quad, challenge your balance as well though. Here we go, let's get started in three, two, one, and let's go. Bring the right leg up. Good, and go at your pace right here. If you wanna hold it for three, four, five seconds, please do so. We're doing this for 30 seconds. Gauge your body, that's what we wanna do. We wanna scan our body right here. Before we start revving our engine, we wanna check all the gauges. We wanna check every part of our body to see, okay, what feels good, what's awake, what's a little tight, what do I need a little more work on? If you fall off your balance, it's all good, you're human, I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna challenge, I'm gonna fail. That's all part of the process. And time. Let's start to move a little bit more. We're gonna do a lunge and a twist. So whatever leg is out in front, that's the leg that you're gonna to twist for, okay? Here we go, in five, four, three, two, and let's get it. Big step and rotate. Good, drive back. So I want you pushing off that front leg. Again, go at your pace. If you wanna follow my pace, you can follow my pace. If you wanna follow Yvonne, you can follow hers. Or if you wanna follow your own, you do you. Stay in your lane, stick to your intention that you said it may be to sweat today, and maybe to have some fun, and maybe just, hey, look, I gotta get a deposit in. I only got 15 minutes to get a workout in, that's why I'm doing this. Perfect, next thing we're gonna do is body weight squats. Get your feet just a little wider, shoulders apart, chest up. I want you to push your arms out when you go down to the bottom. Really sink those hips, okay? And stand up tall in two, one, and let's go, ready? Good, nice and controlled. If you feel like you wanna sit down there a little longer, move side to side, do so. If you feel like, hey, you know what? I'm feeling pretty good today. I think I wanna get after this. Then you can start to pick it up. I want you to go and inhale on the way down, and then exhale at the top. Look, get those arms out. Make sure that your weight is on your heels. Your knees are just behind those toes. You got four more seconds in three, two, one and time. Next one, we're gonna start to get a little bit more dynamic right here. First one we're gonna do is cross jack. So my legs cross, my arms cross, like this. But I wanna challenge your mind by switching them up every time. Let's do it, two, one, and go. Cross jacks here. See, I gotta make you think, always in the warm up. We never wanna just go through the motions. We wanna be mindful in our movement patterns. We're controlling every movement. We're controlling every pattern. Staying engaged on those toes. Here we go, we got 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and time. The next one we're gonna go into is a little bit of a bounce and a deceleration, pogo hop. One, two, three, stick. One, two, three, stick side to side, stay with me on all these reps. Ready, and let's go. One, two, three, left. One, two, three, right. One, two, three, left. One, two, three, right. Beautiful, one, two, three, left. One, two, three, right. 
One, two, three, left, halfway. One, two, three, right, let's go. One, two, three, left. One, two, three, right. One, two, three, left. One, two, three, right, last one. One, two, three, left, and hold it. Woo, good job. Here we go, right in the squat jack steps. Chest is up, touch, sink down low, touch, sink down low. A little more five minutes here, two, one, and let's go. Now, you may feel that your heart rate starting to pick up because we're attacking the big muscles first, that lower body. That's gonna wake everything up. Nice control here. Eyes are up, chest are up. Relax your face. I don't wanna see any squinting. I don't wanna see those grunting faces. I want those big smiles. Come on, like four, three, two, one, and time. The last one of our warm up, a little bit more dynamic. We're going this one, two, three, four. Down, back up. One, two, three, four. Down, back up. Stay with me or go at your own pace. Go. One, two, three. Let's go. Love it. One, two, three, four. Come on. One, two, three, four. Let's get it. You don't have to add the push up but you can if you want to. I'm never gonna hold you back if you wanna elevate. Come on. One, two, three, four. Let's go. One, two, three, four. The last one. One, two, three, four. Hit the deck and back up. Excellent job. Big smiles. We are ready to work. Let's get after this. Circuit number one. You've got four exercises, two sets each, 30 seconds of work, about 15 seconds rest. Into the next one, you know the deal. I'm only gonna show you one at a time, first time through. That's what makes it fun, it's a surprise. Let's grab one dumbbell, all you need is one. First one we're doing right here, it's gonna be a goblet squat. Eyes are up, chest are up, toes slightly pointed out, sinking down low, all the way up. You've got 30 seconds, and then we're gonna place that dumbbell down. This circuit is gonna be some weights and it's gonna be some quick feet and some cardio all mixed into one, okay? Bring your effort, bring your A game, and let's get after this thing. We are on it in 10 seconds. Let's take that intention. Let's get that mind right, let's get the heart right. Ready, here we go, two, one, and go. Sink down low, nice and control. So within those 30 seconds, we're getting anywhere from 10 to 15 reps. Again, go at your pace, focus on that form, weight back on your heels. Every time you come up, squeeze your butt at the top. Nice and control. Here we go. We got eight seconds. Good, in five, four, three, two, one. Drop that dumbbell down. Give yourself some distance from your other dumbbell because the next drill is gonna look like this. Crossing over side to side. We got crossover for 30 seconds. Mixing a little bit of strength with some cardio. Two, one, and go. So your outside leg is leading here. Think of it like this. A drill I always tell my athletes when they're doing this, think of it running over here, running over here, running over here, running over here. Good. It gets you to cross your body up. Even in our runs, we're working in that transverse rotational plane. Come on now, we got five more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. You're gonna need to grab both dumbbells for the next one. What you're doing is a bent over row. Unlock your knees, bend your hips back, and just row. Here we go in three, two, one. Let's get after it. Bend down, nice and control. You wanna focus right here on keeping your back nice and straight. You don't want to throw your head forward. You want to keep a nice neutral posture. Drive those elbows all the way back and squeeze at the top. You've got 10 seconds now. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Time. Get a little bit wider than shoulder width apart because the next one we go lateral. High knees, one, two, stick, one, two, stick. Two in the middle, one on the outside. 30 seconds, 
I'm already sweating. It's only the first set. Let's go. Side to side. Now be mindful where those dumbbells are. But look at this. You just got a little gym for yourself right here. You've got some hurdles. You've got some weights. You've got some energy. And you got the most important thing you need. Your body and your mindset. 10 seconds now. Let's go. Ah, five, four, three, two, one, one down. Excellent, excellent job. Catch your breath. I'm gonna give you just a tad longer rest. Not too long, because we're gonna get right back into it. Learn it in the first set. Own it in the second set. Here we go. Grab that dumbbell, we're right back to goblet squat. Sinking down low, 30 seconds to work. Here we go, pick up your pace if you can. And let's go. Nice control. Even if you go a little quicker, I still want you to maintain that good form. If something hurts, if it's painful, here's my tip, don't do it. Now don't mistake your lungs burning or your muscles burning for the pain. That's your body saying, thank you, we're getting better. Come on, five, four, Three, two, one, drop it down. Here we go, make sure you have some space. Be aware of your surroundings right here. Here we go. Picking it up now, get nice and loose. We're on five, four, three, two, one. Game on, let's go, let's go. Side to side, pump those arms, drive that leg up. Let's work. Keep your eyes at that 45 degree angle. As an athlete, you can see everything out of your peripheral vision. Drive your legs up. You're not tired, you're inspired. And we're getting to work. We're taking advantage of that inspiration right now with some sweat equity. In three, two, one, time. Grab the dumbbells, back to the rows. Beautiful work. Here we go. In five, four, three, Two, one, unlock the knees, hinge the hips, back straight, and row. And this is that time to control your breathing. Your heart rate goes up, you go right back into strength. Control it. This is more mental challenge than anything right here. Come on now. And you've got 10 seconds to go. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one, time. Drop those dumbbells down. Give yourself some space. Crushing it. Let's go. Big smile. Mm. Here we go. In five, four, three, two, one. Let's get it. Hot feet, side to side. Learn this. One, two, stick. One, two, stick. Come on now. Come on now. Good. Get your arms going. Now you're doing the workout right now, I'm gonna challenge you. I'm gonna put a number up, you're gonna call it out. I got a one up, call it out at home. Come on, keep your head up. You calling out those numbers? Let's go, two, one, time. Excellent job. One down, one circuit to go. Before we blast that finisher. Here we go, the next one right here. Similar concept. We're gonna do a straight move, and then we're gonna get right into a quick feet cardio drill. Again, I'm gonna show you one thing at a time. Surprise, surprise. Don't overthink it. Just stay with me, okay? We've got your back today. Here we go. The first drill that we're doing is like this. Starting here, we do a backwards lunge and press. Backwards lunge and press. So as I step into the lunge, my arms come up into that curl and press. So. It's all about staying in sync with these drills right here. Here we go. Ready? First one is up. Backward lunge, curl and press. In two, one, and go. This first set, go at your own pace, okay? If you feel like you gotta learn it first, go slow, get a couple reps, do so. If you feel like, you know what, Brian, I got this. I'm good. Cut the brakes. Let's go, then get after it. 
Come on now. We got eight seconds. Control, lunge, and press. Three, two, one, and time. I want you to bring those dumbbells just about shoulder width apart, because the next drill, we're going skaters over the weights. Want to bring them closer? Do so. Ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, and go. Now, if you want to challenge yourself, you can bring them farther. But what I want to see is you owning every step side to side. Come on. Use your arms here. Nice controlled. We've got 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and time. Good work. Nice job. We're riding to the next exercise, which is V-chop. One dumbbell. Right in the middle. Rotate and chop. Rotate and chop. Making that big V. Two, one. Let's get it. Again, go at your pace right here. If you want to follow along with both of us or one of us, do so. But don't feel pressured. The goal here is that you got it in. You play to your strengths. You play to your intention. Make sure you pivot that back foot. Squeeze your glute to the top. In three, two, one, and time. The next one, we're gonna go into a little bit of a hop. Hop, 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 hop. Nice control, soft landing. Absorb the impact, let's get it. Two, one, go. Hop, hop. Try to keep your feet close together. Come on. This right here is more about coordination than anything else. If you gotta step into it, you can step into it and do just like this. If that hop is tough, then go into that side step. Yvonne's hopping. She's getting after it. Here we go. In four, three, two, one. We are already back to the top. We're feeling good. I think let's get right into it. Here we go. I know you're feeling good. Let's go. Grab the weights. We ready. In three, two, one, go. Backwards lunge and press. There we go. Good, big swing. Get those up there. Love it. Need it. Come on. We want some more. Oh, it's burning. We want some more. It's tough. We want some more. 10 seconds. Come on now. Five, four, three, two, one. Boom. Drop them down. Way to get after it. That's the way to get right into it. Right on those skaters next. Remember, use your arms to propel yourself out. Here we go. In three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. Big jump side to side. Bend that knee. Absorb the impact. Just like we did in that warm up with the pogo hops. Get back to that. Stay focused when you're tired. When fatigue sets in, you gotta be locked in. Let's go. Five seconds now. Five, four, three, two, one. Back to those beat shots. Give me some. Killing it. The power of group energy. You got synergy. People training hard, feet off it. Ready? In three, two, one. Let's go. Big chop all the way up. Come on. Give me that big twist. Pivot that foot. We getting to work now. Halfway there. Show yourself what you're made of. Show yourself what you can do. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Time. Drop it down. Hop side to side. Stand tall. Don't put your hands on your knees. Big inhale. Stand tall. Here we go. In three, two, one. Let's go. Come on. We're on those hops. 
Here we go. Good, remember, you gotta have that step, have that step. Side to side, all I want you to do one thing. I just want you moving, non-stop. Here we go, we got this. Use those arms, 10 seconds now. Come on, let's feed off that energy. Get it now, four, three, two, one. What, what? We can't be almost done. We can't be, I'm feeling good now. We can just have this thing going. But we gotta go into our finisher. I'm really excited about the finisher. It's 20 seconds, 10 second rest, two rounds, and here's the catch. It's nonstop. So we're not taking a break after the first set, okay? I'm gonna show you all the drills right here first, just so you know, remember them. The first one you have right here is you have a rotational press. This is the first one. The second one is you have a reverse fly. Now you're bringing those arms out wide. The third one, you're dropping down into that push-up. And the fourth one, you gotta hit the gun show, bicep curls. 20 seconds, 10 seconds of work, bring your A game, okay? You're gonna wanna cut the sleeves off your t-shirt after the circuit, all right? Ready, here we go. Two rounds, let's crush it. All right, grab those dumbbells. Here we go. Two, one, and let's do it. Nice control. So we have that rotational press, palms facing us, palms facing away. Try to squeeze your glutes. It's gonna keep your core engaged. Don't arch your back that much. All the way up. Come on now, we got this. Don't stop when it burns. And time, here we go. Hold on to those dumbbells. We are not dropping them, okay? I'm gonna give you that side view right here. We'll angle ourselves to the side. You got reverse flies, and go. Whew. Nice control. Drive your elbows back. Again, be mindful of your neck. Let's go. Come on now. We've got 10 seconds, 10, nine, eight, ooh, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Drop it on down for those push-ups. Here we go. We're on in five seconds. Oh my goodness, I'm already feeling that pump. Two, one, go. Go at your pace right here. If you wanna drop your push-ups, you'll go down to your knees and all the way up. You'll still drop your hips down. Notice Yvonne's off her knees. I'm showing you the modification on your knees, all the way down, all the way up. Inhale down, exhale all the way up. In two, one, and time. Grab those dumbbells. Stand tall. You ready for those gun show? She came prepared. I don't know why I didn't wear a cutoff on today's workout. Let's go. All the way up. Big squeeze at the top. Ha. Ah. You're now starting to kick in. You're now starting to burn. Come on now, we got it. Big squeeze. We're on it for five more seconds. All the way up. In two, one. Do not think about dropping those dumbbells. Don't even think about it. Hold them in your hand. You have one more set and we're done. You're a warrior, you got this. Go, up, 20 seconds. If it's burning, you're doing it right. If your arms feel like they're on fire, it's your body saying thank you. You can say you're welcome. Come on, five seconds. Three, two, one. Don't drop them, don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. Come on now. You got your reverse flies next. Ready? Two, one, go. Arms are out nice and wide. Let's get it. Come on now. Big squeeze that upper back. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We've got five seconds to go. Four, three, two, one, time. Drop it on down for those push-ups. Oh my, at least you get a little break with those arms. A little break. Two, one, and go. Come on now. All the way down, all the way up. You gotta go on your knees, that is completely fine. You just have to work, that's the only rule. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I want it to end. 
I don't want it to end. Here we go. And let's get it. Gun show. Take a look at that left bicep. Take a look at that right bicep. We getting after it. Let's go 10 seconds. Big squeeze at the top. Five, four, three, two, one. And done. Amazing, amazing job today. You crushed it. If you're feeling like you got a little pump around this region, you did it right. Amazing job, let's stretch it out real quick. First thing I want you to do is just bring that arm all the way over your head. We're gonna do a quick little tricep stretch. Arm is all the way up, oh my goodness. There is so much power in accountability. Having a workout buddy, having a partner, just being in the same room as somebody who's working hard. You feed off it. And it doesn't matter what level they're at. The only matter, the thing that matters is the level that they bring, that intensity. And you can see somebody working hard. Two, one, time. Shake your arms out, we're gonna do the other side. Great, great, great job. Here we go. Left side comes up. Right arm pulls at the elbow. And try to keep your chest up right here. Really try to bring that arm back. Control your breathing here. Be proud of yourself for the effort you just put in. Two, one, and time. You're gonna drop down to the ground. We're gonna go right into an up dog position right here. Good, so we're facing here. We're gonna throw those hips up and we're back. I want you to bend those legs back and forth, side to side. Doing that big stretch in your hamstrings, pushing your head in between your arms. Holding this position here. Good, I want you to walk the hands all the way back. Just let your arms hang down. Let them hang and hold this position. We're focusing on our breath. Big inhale. Big exhale. Control your breathing right here. You just crush that workout. The last thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go one big inhale from the ground. Big inhale, reach those arms all the way up. I'm going to give my partner a huge high five today and you as always get a huge high five. Thank you so much. It takes a lot to make the time to put in the effort to get a little bit better. And you know that saying, if it was easy, everybody would do it. If you can keep it simple by just committing 10, 15, 20 minutes of getting it in, it's 15 minutes of fit, you bust your butt. I'm proud of you. I can't wait to start with you soon.